All right, what's up, UVA family? This is Smash coming to you from Village Lanes, Durham, North Carolina, home of the Southeast Draft. And so let's go inside and check out all the hot action we got going on on the lanes. We're here with Mal Williams, uh, Southeast uh, main man for everything events related. That's right. Explain the event to people that don't know. Explain how the event is set up and, and how it and how it goes. What like what what's the makeup of the team? So it's a scratch event, but the one one heavyweight, one vixen, one cruiserweight, and a tag team combo of a uh, 430 cap. So both three games, top five advance. Those top five teams, the number five seed, both number four seeds. And we break up in pairs. So the, Vic, the, the Vixens go against each other, heavyweights against each other, cruiserweights against each other, and the tag team split up. Each one bowling against each other. Three out of five wins for those those matches advance. Yeah, it's, so. a, very, it's a very good event here for, in the South. Um, we always fill it up, fill the house. Um, a bigger house for it. Yeah, I mean, it, I mean, it's right there with Unholy as far as selling out stuff really quick. And, and, uh, you can bowl with anybody. You can bowl with anybody on any franchise. So. Yep. We're at Village Lanes, checking out the Southeast Draft. They are bowling there. You know what off. You be all day. You guys know what it is. This is Jay Smith doing what we do, representing Minister Society. Let's go. My name is Robin Cobbs, and I represent the Sneaky Bandits. We was established last year. Right now, we are in the bottom, but that's okay. Just watch out, we're coming for you. That uh, we, we were coming down and look for some people to talk to, and, and we look up in the tent, and bam, he throws that last shot, gets the 300, man. Congratulations. Yeah. I told you we just picked up that Brooklyn shot that you did. That was the only ball I threw like crap that game. Yeah, I'm sure you got that one on camera though. All right, we're here with Nick, uh, Mr. Christie. Uh, we see you got front four going here. How'd you do first game? Oh, uh, team we shot 11.50. We had one 160, and then the low game after that was 233. It wasn't me, but I had 236, so. Okay, at least you weren't the 160, right? That's the main thing. I don't think I'd be doing this interview if I did that. associated with this guy. Uh, Sorry, I look good enough anyway. Just so you got the whole Captain Morgan pose going here for this interview. Yo, 
How's your bowling though? I pulled the ball like way left, so far left. I thought, uh, yeah, it wasn't gonna come back, and it didn't. And I opened. Oh well. Yeah. My favorite team is Sub Zero. I'm from Baltimore, and my favorite player is my dad. And um, Jeffrey. What is on the back of his jersey? Sub Zero. Mr. Uh, Senzo here. Um, how you doing today, sir? Doing all right. Yeah, we're doing all right. We shot 1,200 in the first game. We got what? a little bump in the road this game, but looking to bring it back game three. What's the number going to be to get to the top five, you think? Top five? I'm thinking 3,500. 3,500, right. Mal, Mal predicted 3,450. So 3,500 would definitely get you in the step ladder. Yep. How, um, how's everything goes going for the Hitman this season? Um, well, we've had some adversity this year. You know, we, in all of our existence, we've always been first place in the division, and right now we're in second. But uh, we have outcasts coming up at position round at uh, Pleasant Valley, so. So that should get y'all right back in first, Ben, with what you're doing, because Hitman win everything. Yeah, Hitman win everything, you know. Yep. Yep. Let's go! Hey, guys, it's Leonard Burnett. It's Leonard Burnett. Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! Fishman, how you doing tonight, sir? Good, good, pretty good. What? Uh, how'd you shoot first game? 254. I had the front six or seven, then uh, left the four pin, and then another uh, bad count in the tenth. But good, good way to start. We shot 1100 something to start, but some high scoring today. First game, I'm seeing high 1100s, 1200s, higher 280, 290 scores. It's it's going to be tough, but uh, I think once the transition starts breaking down here, you're going to start seeing where the all the scores start dipping a little bit and what the right moves to make. New cruiserweight champ. Uh, congratulations on the win yesterday. Uh, how, how'd your match go? Uh, it was rough. Uh, we battled out. We battled out. He throws it good. So. He throws it good. You, uh, I believe, uh, 299. One of those games. Yep. Had a solid nine left on the last ball. It happens. It happens. So you, you beat him in five, right? You said you, uh, four two. Four two. Right. Beat him in six. Okay. Um, your opponent next month, a guy named Patrick, right? Patrick Rogers. Um, how you see that match going? Uh, hopefully, same outcome. Hopefully, I retain. So, he's tough, but I'm coming with everything I've got. Uh, Kareem Muhammad, who uh, successfully defended his uh, welterweight championship yesterday. How you bowling today, man? Not much better. But you won yesterday. Yeah, I won, but he, he couldn't pick up his spares. It was a spare game. Yeah, you're all day, baby. Let's get it.